finally a trial. Among the audience, the director of Charlie Hebdo. Also present, Lasana Batini, an employee of Iber Carcher, the kosher supermarket that was assaulted after the magazine headquarters. He's one of about 200 plaintiffs in the trial. Ten of the accused arrived at the Paris courthouse in a heavily armed police motorcade. Another defendant, now freed, was also present. Three others, believed to be still at large or dead, are being tried in absentia, including the wife of one of the gunmen. C'est une colère, c'est une indignation parce que pour ne prendre que le cas de Hayat Boumediene, elle aurait pu être dans le box. Elle vit librement alors que des personnes, les familles des victimes sont aujourd'hui privées, amputées d'une partie de leur vie. 17 people died at the hands of three jihadists before they were killed by police. Charlie Hebdo, which lost 12 lives, this week reprinted the controversial caricatures of Prophet Mohammed that the government cited as their motivation. L'esprit de Charlie Hebdo, c'est ça. C'est refuser de renoncer à nos libertés, de renoncer au rire, de renoncer à la liberté de critique, de renoncer y compris au blasphème, parce que si nous y renonçons, alors nous préparerions un avenir bien obscur pour nos enfants. The first few weeks of the trial will be spent on hearing testimonies from plaintiffs and witnesses. It will be some time before defendants speak in court.